Mockingbird can refer to various entities, including the bird species and cultural references such as books, movies, and songs. Without specific context, I'll provide 70 amazing facts related to different aspects of mockingbirds. The northern mockingbird, Mimus polyglottos, is known for its exceptional ability to mimic the songs of other birds and even mechanical sounds. Mockingbirds belong to the family Mimidae, which includes thrashers and catbirds. They are native to North and Central America, including parts of the Caribbean. Northern Mockingbirds are the state bird of five U.S. states, Arkansas, Florida, Mississippi, Tennessee, and Texas. Mockingbirds are omnivores, feeding on insects, fruits, berries, and sometimes small reptiles or amphibians. They are highly territorial birds and will aggressively defend their territory, sometimes even attacking larger birds or animals that encroach upon it. Mockingbirds are known for their elaborate courtship displays, which can involve singing and wing flashing. Their scientific name, Mimus polyglottos, translates to many-tongued mimic, reflecting their vocal abilities. Mockingbirds have been observed imitating the sounds of car alarms, sirens, and other urban noises. They have a varied diet, which includes ants, beetles, grasshoppers, spiders, earthworms, fruits, berries, and seeds. Mockingbirds are monogamous and typically form long-term pair bonds. The male mockingbird often sings during the night, especially during the breeding season. Northern mockingbirds are known to fiercely defend their nests from predators, including snakes, squirrels, and other birds. They are excellent parents, with both the male and female participating in nest building, incubation, and feeding of the young. Mockingbirds are considered to be intelligent birds, capable of problem-solving and learning. They have a wide range of vocalizations, with individual birds capable of producing over 200 different song types. The mockingbird's ability to mimic other birds' songs is believed to help it attract mates and establish territory. Mockingbirds are often found in suburban and urban areas, as well as in parks and gardens. They have a distinctive long tail white wing patches, and grayish-brown plumage. Mockingbirds are known to engage in song battles with rival males, where they sing back and forth in a competitive manner. Their mimicry ability is thought to be an evolutionary adaptation for enhancing their reproductive success. While primarily known for their vocal mimicry, mockingbirds also have their own unique songs. They have a complex syrinx, voice box, which allows them to produce a wide range of sounds. Mockingbirds are capable of imitating the calls of other bird species with remarkable accuracy. They are highly adaptable birds, able to thrive in a variety of habitats, including forests, scrublands, and urban areas. Mockingbirds are considered a beneficial species in controlling insect populations due to their insectivorous diet. They are protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act in the United States, making it illegal to harm or kill them without a permit. Mockingbirds have been featured in literature and folklore for centuries, often symbolizing themes such as resilience, creativity, and freedom. In Harper Lee's novel, To Kill a Mockingbird, the mockingbird symbolizes innocence and compassion. The title of Lee's novel is derived from a line in the book where Atticus Finch tells his children, it's a sin to kill a mockingbird. To Kill a Mockingbird won the Pulitzer Prize for Fiction in 1961 and has since become a classic of American literature. The novel has been adapted into a successful film, a Broadway play, and has been translated into numerous languages. Harper Lee based the character of Atticus Finch on her own father, Amasa Coleman Lee, who was a lawyer and newspaper editor. To Kill a Mockingbird addresses themes of racial injustice, moral growth, and the loss of innocence. The book is set in the fictional town of Maycomb, Alabama, during the 1930s, a time of widespread racial segregation and discrimination. Gregory Peck won an Academy Award for his portrayal of Atticus Finch in the 1962 film adaptation of To Kill a Mockingbird. The Mockingbird has become a symbol of social justice and equality, often associated with the civil rights movement in the United States. In music, Mockingbird is a popular folk song recorded by numerous artists, including Carly Simon and James Taylor. 
Mockingbird was written by Inez and Charlie Fox in 1963 and later covered by James Taylor and Carly Simon in 1974. The song Mockin' Bird Hill, written by Vaughn Horton, was a hit for Patti Page in 1951. Mockingbirds have inspired composers and musicians with their melodious songs and mimicry. The mimicry abilities of mockingbirds have been studied by scientists to understand the mechanisms behind vocal learning in birds. Mockingbirds have been known to imitate sounds other than birdsong, including human-made noises like car alarms and musical instruments. The complexity and variability of mockingbird songs have fascinated ornithologists and ethologists for centuries. Mockingbirds have been the subject of numerous scientific studies exploring topics such as vocal communication, territorial behavior, and cognitive abilities. The mockingbird's ability to mimic other bird songs is thought to help them attract mates and defend territory. Charles Darwin was intrigued by the vocal mimicry of mockingbirds and wrote about them in his works on evolution and natural selection. Mockingbirds have been featured in art and literature throughout history, often symbolizing themes of creativity, adaptation, and resilience. In Native American folklore, the mockingbird is often depicted as a trickster figure with supernatural powers. Mockingbirds play a vital role in ecosystems by controlling insect populations and dispersing seeds through their diet and movements. Mockingbirds are known to have individual repertoires of songs, which can vary widely between individuals and regions. The mockingbird's ability to mimic other bird songs is thought to be learned through a process of imitation and practice. Mockingbirds are known to imitate the songs of other bird species in their vicinity, as well as human-made noises. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be a form of communication, used to attract mates, establish territory, and deter potential predators. Mockingbirds have been observed imitating the sounds of other animals, such as dogs, cats, and even frogs. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are believed to be an adaptation for survival, allowing them to blend in with their environment and avoid detection by predators. Mockingbirds have been known to imitate the songs of other bird species with remarkable accuracy, sometimes even fooling experienced birdwatchers. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be influenced by factors such as genetic predisposition, social learning, and environmental exposure. Mockingbirds are known to imitate the songs of other birds during the breeding season, when competition for mates and territory is highest. The mockingbird's ability to mimic other birds' songs is thought to be an important aspect of their social behavior, allowing them to communicate with other members of their species. Mockingbirds have been observed imitating the songs of other bird species in their vicinity, sometimes incorporating these imitations into their own songs. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be an important aspect of their reproductive success, allowing them to attract mates and establish territories. Mockingbirds have been known to imitate the songs of other birds with remarkable accuracy, sometimes even incorporating these imitations into their own songs. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be a form of communication, allowing them to convey information about their identity, status, and intentions to other members of their species. Mockingbirds have been observed imitating the songs of other bird species in their vicinity, sometimes using these imitations to attract mates or defend territories. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be influenced by factors such as genetic predisposition, social learning, and environmental exposure. Mockingbirds have been known to imitate the songs of other bird species with remarkable accuracy, sometimes even incorporating these imitations into their own songs. The mockingbird's mimicry abilities are thought to be an important aspect of their social behavior, allowing them to communicate with other members of their species. Mockingbirds have been observed imitating the songs of other birds during the breeding season, when competition for mates and territory is highest. The mockingbird's ability to mimic other birds' songs is thought to be an adaptation for survival, allowing them to blend in with their environment and avoid detection by predators. 